My queen, with the Overmind and its Cerebrates destroyed, all of the Zerg in this sector have reverted to your direct control. The remnants of the UED fleet have fled the planet, but I have no idea how many functional ships they still possess. We have finished relocating your primary hive clusters to this orbital platform. However, we do have a problem. Somehow, Zeratul and his brethren were able to bypass our defenses and steal their matriarch away from us. Damn Zeratul. He is a formidable adversary. Where have they run to, Duran? Our scouts report that they have regrouped with a number of protest survivors on the surface of Char. The matriarch is being held within a stasis cell, leading me to suspect that the Protoss will attempt to take her home to Shakuras. <laughs> they still believe that she can be saved from my influence. Zeratul will be very disappointed to learn that Rashigal is beyond redemption. How much time before their fleet is ready to debark for Shakuras? They will be capable of dimensional recall within 30 minutes, my queen. That may be all the time we need. Cerebrate, mobilize all of my broods and send them to the surface of Char. I want you to bring both the Matriarch and Zeratul to me alive. Terminate the remaining Protoss with extreme prejudice. Da da, laggy. Hey everyone, welcome back to StarCraft. Uh, so in this mission we have a 30 minute mission. Which is not actually 30 minutes, mostly because the game goes much faster than it actually says. Uh, and also the fact that uh, we have to do it in 25, because we get a bonus mission if we do it in 25 minutes. So, that's what we're aiming for. And I've already made two attempts at this mission already. And uh, so far, not doing too well. Uh, Reavers kicked my ass. Um, as per suggestion, in the comments last time, I tried to do a Zergling Hydralisk attack. They have Psy Storm and Hydralisks, which uh, all fuck your day, so... Uh, no, we're going, we're going with the good old tried and true uh, Guardian attacks. We're gonna go to actually send these guys over here to attack that, that little... Actually, well, I don't really need to send them. Well, do I have to... I mean, they're not doing anything else for the time being, so... You know, I might as well send them do that. So, the reason I got gas first was because gas is extremely, extremely important in this mission. Um, it, you cannot support an army uh, with what I have, basically. So I have to basically invest into the gas that's required for that. And yeah, you scan that, good job. Alright, we're gonna get that guy, another drone. Alright, so these guys are gonna go attack that. Let's get some more minerals coming down the pipe. Because the minerals, once once I have those at, at critical mass, uh, those won't be a problem anymore. I figure I might as well just get these while I have time. And... I don't know how much more I have to, have to get here. Okay, good. We have an, we had another overlord coming, so that's okay. Okay, so I think now we need to go get the more mutilists. I know I don't have much production, but uh, it actually should be okay, at least for the time being. I've also learned that Guardians are kind of retarded. They kind of randomly go into range of pretty much anything. Alright, so now they're going to just have fun over here doing that. I think that's good for... Uh, yeah, that's good for overloads for now. And we need Guardians. Good stuff. We can get one more. One more drone. Just to maximize production here. Maximize production. All right, and here we go. We got two more. As I said, the gas, the gas is gonna be the biggest problem on this on this level. Uh, but if we now basically just head back after this, all right. Now we can go back. Do we have another one coming? No. We'll just we'll 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 go with seven, and we're gonna go capture that base down there. And then, uh, then I don't really know. Just I can get some Zerglings to go and be fodder. Because I actually have a lot of resources, so... Alright, come on down. Uh, I guess the Hydralis will protect the Guardians. Alright, so let's go just, uh... I want to take out that bunker. Let's 
Because that once that goes down, they don't have much else. Alright, now we're going to send the Zerglings over to attack that base, so go ahead. Up on in. And... We're now... Oh, wait, what? Where are they getting tanked from? Oh, great, great work there. To send one guy there. Oh, they also have a fuck ton of uh, guardians, apparently. No, not guardians, sorry. Oh, what? What are you doing? Where did he even come from? Well, luckily he'll still be there for the main attack. I don't know, maybe I had him hot hot heat or something. I'm, I'm even surprised that the, the, the other puny little force took out my uh, my Zergling squad. But it was probably that, that Firebat's fault. Alright. So that's basically the it for that. And we're just gonna send this guy right over here. Oh wow, okay. Make sure there's nothing else there. That, that kind of blows, not gonna lie, but that's it. That's all I really wanted though. Now we, that, that this silly thing is kind of blocking the way and then now we can kind of rebuild the list. And there we go. And now we're now we're building forces. I think I think he's good enough now to handle kind of being with the with the group here. And they'll all kind of hang out together. And this guy will be in the back just so that he doesn't get targeted anymore. And now we have a ton of uh, we have a ton of minerals actually. Uh, sorry, a ton of resources. Not uh, like in terms of minerals, not, not anything else. So you know it, we could spend that on on I don't know something else. But I'd rather just. Uh, get this geyser up ASAP. We're gonna just use it on defenses and things like that. And overlords. What are they doing over here? Oh, okay, another medic. You blinded my ultralisk. Okay. Right. You're pro as fuck. Okay, so let's take out the rest of this. Now, we do have things coming along, so... I mean, I, I don't think we're that fucked. I think we're pretty good, actually. We're gonna just uh, get ready to start production right away. And I lost a guardian. Could probably use a couple more drones down there. Just to just to just to make uh, some some stuff, you know. Cause the gas actually needs to start coming ASAP. And then these guys can also turn into Guardians. Then we're gonna get like, I don't know, a couple Devourers. We don't really need that many. And then we'll begin attacking. To be honest, I don't think I'm gonna have a whole lot of uh... We'll put, we'll put one more guy in a geyser for good measure here. Although, uh, yeah, it's been pretty much, like, perfect. There, so... Oh, don't kill him. Alright, let me just get some units over here. Alright. This guy can hang out here too. Uh, now we need, now we need loads of mutalists. Once again, our inability to produce proper, uh, can I, can I make a, can I make a guy here? Oh, uh, no, I can't. I just want to make a spore here. See, just that's all I wanted. And then, like, one more sunken over there. That should pretty much do it for defenses here. I mean, I I, I didn't attack here to begin with. With respect to, uh, all right, let's see how many we have here. So we got five here. Okay, two more of these guys, and that should do it for my guardians. I also need to get a uh, overlord speed. And then they're going to start making their way over there, because uh, we don't have a lot of time, actually. They're going to attack this base really slowly, too. Hey, you you found something. Uh, 
hopefully I'm not going to get absolutely wrecked, but I may not have a choice in that matter. Yeah, everyone. Okay, go up there. I mean, the Ultralis is just going to hang out there. I mean, the, the, the Devourers aren't that expensive, though. But they're expensive enough to make me worry. We should also get these guys to follow. Although, uh, they're extremely painfully slow. Actually, you guys can take up that. And Devourers don't actually cost that much. They are my anti air. Their strength is mostly in the acid spores. Oh, what? oh god. Hello, cluster. I like how I like their little retaliation there. Wow. That that did a lot of damage. That, now you know my pain of what the fuck this mission is. So I gotta just basically spread these guys out and hope I don't die. Alright, let's go give it a shot. What are you guys doing? No, no, don't kill- He's killing my weakest one. This is not going too well. Okay, this is going much more horribly than I would have ever hoped that it would go. I mean, these, are, these guys are tanky as balls, and they're still getting absolutely fucking face wrecked. Actually, I don't need any more of these guys. Yeah, you're dead. Well, at least I didn't lose any of the Guardians yet. Yet is the key word. Alright. Okay. Uh, guy, guys, come on over. Let's try this again. Remember, I, I have until the five minute mark and then I lose, so. There we go. Okay, so that should be enough. See, it's Devourer's D. So, when you want Devourer's, it's, you want the D. That's how it works. Alright, I didn't get the spores here, but not like it really mattered. Alright. Now, nah, let's try attacking again. Oh god. No, don't go into that. I gotta save this as something, because seriously. Look at all these fucking guys they have. I think I think we're good now though. Oh wait, these guys are not with me. They they can't attack very quickly though. Uh are we good there? Okay. Looks like we are. Alright, just kind of hang out with these guys. Okay, I think we're good now. I think I think it's fine. Why is it go keep going the hive cluster is under attack? There's nothing clearly nothing attacking the hive cluster. Hive cluster will do just fine without me. Oh no, kill that guy. Kill that motherfucker right there. I think we've basically taken out everything, because I'm pretty sure they would have stormed me some more had it not been for... They were now descending very slow. Oh god, what are you doing? You're blind. Oh wait, actually, let's kill this guy. Oh, look at that vulture. Dark Templar kind of... Uh, Dark Archons kind of scare me. I think that's pretty much it. You see these Reavers? These Reavers are death. That's what they are. Fucking 10 scarabs and everything. Fucking Reavers. Alright, so we're gonna bring these guys in the middle here and then just transform them into uh, what I could call super cool extra mutilist mode. Stop going up there. 
No, they're going they're going into Guardians, because I don't really need anything else. Do you notice how they all attacked but they actually lost their animation there? That's that's something that really annoys me about the What the fuck is this fleet of observers? What are they even doing? I'm pretty sure we win, now it's just mop up time. I mean all I really have to do is all I really have to do is kill their base, so. Luckily, there's a shit ton of guys now for that. And we can also get some more, uh, overlord, underlings or whatever. Make some more of there. Yeah, I think, I think we pretty much have this at this point. We've got lots of time. I don't know why you're not with this group here. What is it? Okay, no. I, I was worried that he was going to do a dark, a, a Templar drop on me again. Dude, that's like the worst thing. Dude, I, I would be so mad if I played competitive StarCraft because of that. Just to, Because I probably wouldn't be playing Protoss, I'd probably be playing Terran. And just getting mad whenever my bio ball gets killed by uh, storms. That shit's not even fair. No, it probably perfectly is fair. Who am I to judge the balance of a, a well-made game? And there we go, we, we almost got it actually. For, for once, a plan went as expected. But my last plan didn't count, so... You know, go figure. Whatever, you don't, you don't have enough time to transform. And kill that guy, just because I don't like leaving survivors. And I, I did it in the nick of time too. Devourers and Guardians, always. Damn you, Kerrigan, for what I must do. Thank you, Zeritu. You have freed me from her vile control at last. You have always served me with honor. Thus, I must ask you to watch over my tribe. Into your hands I give the future. I can hardly believe this. You've killed your own matriarch. Better that I killed her than let her live as your slave, Kerrigan. Well... I have misjudged you, warrior. You are worthy indeed. You are free to go. What? I said you are free to go. I've already taken your honor. I'll let you live because I know that from now on your every waking moment will be torture. You'll never be able to forgive yourself for what I've forced you to do. And that, Zeratul, is a better revenge than I could have ever dreamed of. You will regret this decision, Kerrigan. We shall meet again. You gotta love Kerrigan. She's a great villain in StarCraft 1. Victory! Ah, there we go. We didn't do so bad. Oh, 